If you're new to creating floral designs, it can be a little bit intimidating, but I want to show you just how easy it can be. Here's my easiest floral tutorial. So first apply two coats of your base color and then here, and now I'm going back with a thin layer of tacky top, applying it to the whole nail and not curing. Now I'm taking my white art gel and my gel brush and I'm creating these very loose, quick petal shapes. I'm starting from the top of the petal and pulling down towards where the center of the flower would be. On this nail, I decided to do two large flowers, but it's up to you. I often suggest usually doing it in odd numbers, but for some reason I really liked how these two large ones looked. Now we're going in and we're going to fill in some of that empty space and all I'm doing is using the existing product on the brush and I'm just using kind of the side of it to create these really loose uh, leaf shapes. Once you're happy, go ahead and cure the nail in your Ugly Duckling lamp for 45 seconds. Now I'm taking my favorite Detailer 2 brush and I'm just adding some fine details to those petals, um, kind of defining one side and then also adding a stem if needed. I'm really focusing on trying to use mostly just the point of the brush and this will keep the lines really soft and delicate. So now we're applying some caviar beads and to do that I've applied some no wipe top coat to the center of the flowers and I haven't cured it. And then I've mixed some caviar beads with some stick it and I'm applying those to the center of the flowers and then kind of scattering some outwards and then you're going to cure. Now it's time to make it all matte with Ugly Duckling's award winning matte top coat of course. I'm applying matte to the entire nail and then also those scattered uh, caviar beads and we're going to pop it in the lamp for a 45 second cure. And once it's all cured and we've got it out of the lamp, we're going to go into our next step which is using some gel cleanse, removing that inhibition layer, making sure we um, rub those uh, caviar beads as well to get rid of the inhibition layer from the sticket, and your nail is complete. I hope you guys liked this tutorial and if you recreate this simple floral design, please be sure to tag me on Instagram, give this video a thumbs up, and share it with all your nail tech friends. Until next time, bye! Hey, let's be social. Find me on Instagram at Natasha Harton.